EC2 instance profile is a reference to an IAM role that will be passed and assumed by the EC2 instance when it starts up. So the idea is that the instance profile is really a reference to IAM role and that instance profile is associated with the EC2 instance. The whole purpose is to avoid passing long lived credentials so you don't have to hard code or somehow pass your access key and secret into your, um, into your uh, OS environment. Um, and the way it's really doing this is using STS assume. So if you don't understand that, we cover that in the uh, CLI section. But anyway, EC2 instance profile can be associated at the time of launch or on a running EC2 instance. So if you forget to do this, you can do it after the fact. However, if you never had an EC2 instance profile attached, a hard boot re reboot is required for the role to be assumed because otherwise it will just not work and you will waste a lot of time. This is something we'll definitely demonstrate in a lab because uh, it should be known. Only a single IAM role can be associated with an instance profile. Changing roles is not instantaneous due to eventual consistency, which is why we need a hard reboot in the first case. But if you need the role immediately, you need to disassociate and reassociate the profile or do a hard re reboot of the instance. Uh, when you select the IAM role, when launching an EC2 instance, AWS will automatically create an instance profile for you. So you don't really notice this in the console, but when you definitely use the AWS CLI, you are creating an instance profile um, and you can't see instance profiles anywhere in the management console. The only way you can uh, see a list of them is via the API, which is why we're looking at the CLI commands here. So we have creating the instance profile, adding a single IAM role to an instance profile because you can only have a single role attached to an instance profile. Uh, associate an instance profile um, uh, to the EC2 instance. I'm not sure why I didn't put the word EC2 on the end there, but let's just say to the EC2, EC2, there we go. <laughs> You can list the IAM, IAM uh, I say IAM roles, but it's IAM profiles. Really mucking up here today. Uh, and then you can get information about a specific instance profile. Again, wrote role, but we're saying instance profile here. But there you go.